everyone. In today's video, I will be sharing a Dollar Tree fall haul. I have some fall goodies here. This will be my last fall haul um, for this year. We will jump right into Christmas very, very soon. I have found a ton of Christmas stuff already. I do want to share um, a couple of Christmas items, but I'll share that at the end. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and dig right in. So I did pick up a bonus item. I thought that this was just such a great deal for $5. It is one of their cheese boards. I have bought um, a Christmas board and a Valentine's Day board from their bonus aisle before. For five bucks, you really cannot beat it. I picked up the pumpkin. It does say hello fall on it. You could use it for decor. I do like using like some cutting boards on my backsplash in my kitchen. It's obviously a very functional item. This would be super cute to use for Thanksgiving or a fall favorites party. This is also really cute to gift for like a little hostess gift. <gasps> Isn't it so cute for $5? Yes, please. So when I picked this up, I was thinking like a little Friendsgiving hostess gift to give. So I got the board and then I went around trying to see what they had for like a little charcuterie board. So I found these little maple cookies. They are bite size. They look very, very similar to like the Trader Joe's maple leaf cookies, but these again are bite size. So they're very tiny. They have a little like a leaf embossed on them. These look yummy. I hope that they are good, but just think a like fall Thanksgiving gift basket here. This is... I'm either going to do something sweet or I did pick up some items to do like a more traditional charcuterie board. I think you could still add these to the gift basket and that would still look really cute. So I also picked up these little wheat crackers. Um, they had this box here and they also I think had a blue box. I went with this one. I went with a trail mix. It is a sweet and spicy trail mix. I do want to show a couple of like repeat items. This little um, pumpkin jar, super cute. I was also thinking to add maybe like, maybe get a couple more bags of the trail mix. I can add it to here and then put it in my gift basket. I think that that would be really cute. This is another little repeat item. This little Hello Pumpkin pot mitt with the little spatulas. All of these items would be super cute included in a little fall gift basket. And here is a new little find. These little coffee cups. You get four for $1.25. I love the prints. This one here says Harvest Blessings. And this one says Gather and Be Grateful. More of like a burgundy coffee sleeve here. These are super cute to put at my coffee bar or a little coffee station. These would also be really adorable for like a quick little gift idea. Um, since you get four for $1.25, take them out, put a little bit of paper shred. You can put a little Starbucks or Dunkin' gift card pop the lid back on and you have a really inexpensive gift idea and it's very functional because the receiver could also reuse the cup. These are so cute for gifting. Okay, to go with my charcuterie basket, I also picked up these Kalmata olives and then this little book here. It says Boards and Bite. A couple of years ago, I on my Christmas list, I wanted this like board deck. It gives you so many ideas for charcuterie boards for the entire year holidays, seasons, like football season, you name it, you can find some inspiration and a board for that exact holiday. And I love it. It just gives me so much inspiration. So to see this at the Dollar Tree, I thought it was super neat and just would make such a cute gift idea. Again, to go in like my charcuterie gift basket. I also will probably pick these things up to do a charcuterie gift basket for Christmas. I feel like that is just such a staple gift idea. So if we want to just take a look real quick. Okay, so right here it says, Tis the season for cheese and holiday board. And it gives you a really pretty picture of an idea of how to set your board up. 
It gives you your ingredient list and a little step-by-step -step here. This is exactly like my little uh, card set. Festive Fall Cheese Board. Again, they give you the picture for inspiration, which that is what I always aim for. Give me some inspo. I love seeing how others set up their cheese boards. Again, we have ingredients and a little step-by-step -step process here. <sighs> This is so cool. I absolutely love this. Let's see quickly. Springboard for success. So they are giving us um, board ideas for all of the seasons. Right here it says boards for all seasons. Okay. I love this. Okay, this is going to be so cute in my little Thanksgiving gift basket. Let me know in the comments down below, would you like to see my little fall gift basket? Um, I'm only making one. I only need to gift one. Um, I know I normally do like three to five gift baskets in a video since it is only one. And I think I did one last year. So maybe I could try to like pull that footage and give you guys two. So if you would like to see a fall inspiration gift basket, let me know in the comments comments down below. Okay, moving right along the good. This is the good stuff right here. This is the stuff that keeps <laughs> that keeps the little ones entertained. So I did stock up on these like color your own little decor pieces. This one here says give thanks. They give you the little markers. It's perfect. This one here is a little turkey. That is so cute. We have a little scarecrow. He's holding up a sign that says, hello, fall. And then here is a little pumpkin scene that says, hello, fall. These are super cute. If you wanted to set these out at the kids' table for Thanksgiving, I'm going to let Miss Olivia just get busy with these. I love putting one in my bag. If we're heading out to a restaurant or a coffee shop, things like this just give me a little bit of time and give her some independent play. Okay, moving right along. So I do have a little collection of fall orange ribbon. So I only picked up one ribbon at Dollar Tree and it's this beautiful print with the leaves and mushrooms. I thought it was super pretty to make a bow for my gift basket. And then we have some books. Dollar Tree just keeps knocking it out of the park with all of their books. This one here says The Golden Hour. I also picked up this book here and I picked this one up for myself. It says it's a guided journal, simple and free. And let me just like open it up here. Discover the peace found in a radically simpler life using this guided journal featuring prompts based on the joyful, liberating lessons shared by New York Times bestselling author Jen Hatmaker. Day one, what seven foods will you choose for this month? quickly flipped through this at the Dollar Tree and thought that this would be like a fun little thing to do. I also thought that it would be kind of fun to do it more like junk journaling, kind of scrapbooking, um, maybe tearing out some of the pages and putting it in my junk journal. So for a dollar twenty-five, yes please. Um, okay, I went down the makeup beauty aisle, which is the same aisle with the toothbrushes and I found these here. They're Crayola Sonic Power Toothbrushes by Brush Buddies. So the Brush Buddies, they have come out with this Crayola line before and they gave us the cute little Crayola cup and the matching toothbrush. And now they're giving us a Sonic Powered toothbrush. So I picked up a green one and an orange one. I think that these are just so fun for $1.25 and it also comes with the battery. Yes, please. I think these would be great for stocking stuff so if you see these, I would definitely snag them up. They would be great for gift baskets. I will probably even hold on to these for Easter time because I think that they would be perfect in an Easter basket since they're so like bright and colorful. Um, I did do a Crayola Easter basket theme last year. Maybe I'll redo that. I think that these were just $1.25 immediately add to cart. Okay, down the makeup aisle, I thought that these were super fun. They are little makeup brush sets. You get a five piece for $1.25. It comes in purple as well as pink. 
I think that these are super cute and fun either for traveling or for like little ones. My little girl is four and a half. She would absolutely love this at her little vanity. So I thought that these were super cute. It would be perfect for like a preteen. This would be super cute to add to a gift basket or even for a stocking stuffer. When I saw these, like the color gives off like Valentine's Day. So I was even thinking about maybe holding on to these for a Valentine's Day gift basket as well. Okay, next up, this is a little repeat item that I picked up. I did share it in another haul, but I haven't pulled it out yet, so I thought I would share it again. This is a chair cover, and it's actually really large. How cute is that? I think, so I'm finally going to get to crafting on this. I think it would be super cute to like stuff it and put it as like a giant pillow on the patio furniture, or stuffing it and putting it on my little pumpkin patch. I have like a little DIY like pumpkin patch set up on the patio and I thought oh, it would just be so cute. I had to reshare this so that you could get your hands on it. The last items that I have to share are a Christmas item. I just wanted to share two items today. My huge Christmas haul is coming very, very soon. But they were just stocking these or they were just taking these out of the box boxes this is a 24 inch stackable decor snowman this is a part of their bonus items it was five dollars they gave us this in the pumpkin form quite a few years ago that they bring back every year i believe this is the first year that i have seen the little stackable snowman he's so cute and then they also had a christmas tree i did not pick up kind of regretting it but maybe i'll go back but i did pick up the um presents it's a again a 24 inch stackable decor piece and they are christmas presents okay i'll open this one um I'm already getting all of my Christmas decor set up upstairs. Now, I was thinking about spray painting this one or painting it. Now that I'm home, I'm like, okay, the task seems like a lot. So maybe we'll just keep these fun colors for Olivia. So we have a blue present. We have a green. Okay, we have to hear it lock in. There we go. Same here. Let's hear the lock. Okay, there it is. Nope. Okay, here it is. Ah, uh, it's so pretty. I think this would be super cute outside on my patio. Even if I picked up another set to have it on like each side of the couch. This is so cute. And again, only $5. Alrighty, well that's going to be a wrap for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please let me know what was your favorite item that I hauled in today's video. Let's chat in the comments down below. Again, let me know if you would like to see a fall Thanksgiving inspired gift basket that would just give you some inspiration to maybe give or take as a hostess gift wherever you're having Thanksgiving, Friendsgiving, you name it. Or if you just want to spread some love and show someone that you're thankful for them, just a cute little gift idea, let me know in the comments down below. If you did enjoy today's video, please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out. I can't wait to jump into all of the holiday bliss with creating and crafting and inspiring. If that sounds good to you, don't forget to subscribe before you leave and hit that notification bell so you don't miss my next upload. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.